Ferndale is up in light. Shortland Street, the musical, has had its worldwide premiere in Auckland. It's a large-scale musical comedy which features iconic characters and it is, trust me, a whole lot of fun. We welcome now creator Guy Langford, who also plays Dr Chris Warren. He's very busy in the show. In fact, they all are. And Bronwyn Ture, who is nurse Jackie Manu. It is so good to have you here, guys. Thanks for having me. Congratulations. Yeah. I went to that opening night and I just blew my socks off. From the opening song all the way through, I laughed, I reminisced, I thought it was a great musical journey to go on, so well done. Yeah, thanks. thanks. It was such a great response, how people were cheering. It was amazing, yeah. yeah. And you had a lot of the Shortland Street cast members there from over the past sort of 25 years. Yeah, yeah. we did. How did that feel? Did it add an extra sort of energy to the room, or were you nervous? <laughs> I was I was really nervous, because, you know, you, you, something that people have um, worked on and have um, very proud of and we're very proud of this and so you sort of want everyone to really enjoy themselves and and they did yeah, yeah well you did, did. Well, I did yeah I'm <laughs> on it but oh, I actually, once I was on Shortland Street for two seconds but, uh, <laughs> well you know they didn't ask me to be on this show and I had a whole two oh, lines once sing, but too, I know yeah. no no seriously though Guy well done on this but is th why Shortland Street is this like been your passion for years it, it's been my passion for six years <laughs> to, make, wow. to make this show I had the idea six years ago you know I think I, I wanted to make a show of a, on a grand scale and I thought oh, Shorten Street can really do that. It's an ensemble um, of New Zealanders and that's really the heart of the show is it's a celebration of, of this television show that we love but it's also a celebration of who we are, of our identity and, and so I really, I really clued on pretty quickly that by showing Shortland Street we could look at ourselves and laugh and celebrate, yeah. And yeah. did you find that, Mike? Yeah, I don't know, I did. It was just so, even the opening scene straight away, you knew that you were watching an iconic show that had been turned into a romp, really. It was just a lot of fun. Simon Bennett, Bennett you helped, he helped you write this. Yeah. Uh, you know, what sort of... What sort of um, offerings did he give you when it came to writing? He's like a walking encyclopedia of right. the show. Like yeah. he, he was the producer on the show for many, many years, has directed many episodes. Uh, so he, when he came on and helped me write the script, he had all this comedy gold, like lots of things that I didn't know about that happened in the show that we thought, well, we've got to put that in some way. Uh, and he also really helped us open doors in order to make the thing happen. You yeah. Because we yeah. had to... It was a huge venture in just getting the rights to do it, and so he's been um, he's been instrumental in doing that. Yeah. And you play, you know, the most iconic character. Yeah. Doctor Warner. Doctor yeah. Warner, played originally by Michael Galvin, <coughs> made an amazing cameo appearance Dad. in our opening night. Fantastic. <laughs> the crowd went crazy. Did they? Yeah. Was, was he a... like playing your dad or something? Oh, he, the, we, there's a cameo spot. I won't tell too much. Okay. But there's a surprise and. Uh, Rachel McKenna has been struck by lightning and needs help to come back to life. <laughs> as, so his, as you his do. skills over the years came in handy. Yeah, the other night. yeah. <laughs> his doctoring skills. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So bro, what, what about you? Who do you play in it? I play Nurse Jackie Manu, um, who was originally played by Nancy Brunning, um, and it's it's an amazing role. It's so much fun, and she is fierce and focused and yeah, funny, really, really funny. So. And how hard is it singing songs that, you know, I guess no one's heard before because they are original? Because all the singing I thought was just beautiful. The ballads, the fun songs. Is it hard? You know, I guess you get to stamp your own personality on them. Well, I mean, this guy is so, this guy, um, <laughs> such, such a talent. He made these, created these songs that almost feel like they've been around for ages. Mm, mm. And so even though we are singing them and creating them for the first time, it, they do feel kind of like instant classics. Yes, And definitely. this is, like, I have so much fun singing all of these songs. And then there's ones that I'm not in, that I wish I was in. Yeah. Is, this, well. is this possibly <coughs> Not in Guatemala Now, which is one of the songs that comes it's up? One of my is favorites. that yours? <laughs> it's one of my favourites. It's so much fun. And Bronwyn's amazing. There's a song called The Five Wives of Dr. Warner, where Chris yes. gets... Uh, haunted in a nightmare by the future wives of his future wives and Bronwyn plays one of them very very well <laughs> and I'll tell you something else I noticed too a few people said oh do you have to know the show to get it all I don't think you do Bronwyn do you nah. you're telling the story on stage yeah and I think that the, the best part about it is that you you don't you don't have to have watched back in the day you don't even have to have been alive back in the day um, because it is stuff that you know drama, high drama and high fun that we all know and love. Well, well done. Congratulations on it. And there's some huge stars in there as well. Mike mm. Hardlow's in there, Lisa Chapel oh, as well. Right. You must go and see it. Shortland Street, the musical, is currently playing at Auckland's ASB Theatre. Check out the ATC website for ticket details. And the production is going to tour the rest of the country next year. Very exciting. Which is great news, yes. isn't it? Fantastic.